Okay. Hi, everybody. I'm Alan. I am the uh, director of the audio division. And today, I just want to uh, quickly set expectations for this audiobook cohort so that everyone's on the same page with their producer and uh, so that you can move ahead and get all of your files in on time for the post-production team with everything you need. So let me go ahead and share my screen here. And uh, let's get started. So uh, today's workshop is going to be an overview of the entire four-month program. It is a four-month expectation from start to finish. Uh, those of you that have shorter books might get it done uh, far sooner than that. So four months is the cutoff, however, and we do have uh, deadlines. So we'll talk about that. Setting proper expectations, of course, is the best method for overall success, no matter what kind of project you do. So that's why I wanted to start off our cohort by doing that. So by now, you should have passed your sound test. If you haven't done that, you're behind schedule, you're going to need to catch up. So that's the first thing is, have you passed your sound check already? If you haven't, you want to get with your producer and you want to get that, you know, taken care of. Some, you know, you may not have um, passed it because you may have submitted and uh, you may have not passed the first test or second test. Sometimes it takes three or four because of technical uh, errors or ambient noise in the space you're using. So there's a lot of different reasons why that might be the case. So your raw files, which is the uh, entire first draft of the book, is the Friday of the sixth week of the day you started. So your start date for this cohort was 9-4. Your raw files due date is 10-13. So that we have that date um, in stone and so you understand uh, what's going to happen there. And when we talk about raw recordings, we're talking about um, the entire first draft, all of your redos. You're only going to submit the files to post-production in your Google Drive that you want post-production to hear and your producer is going to work with you on that. So over the next four weeks, you should record 25% of your book each week. That way you get to 100% of your book through the first month. And that gives you two additional weeks to listen to your entire audiobook and do additional takes of the sections that you don't like, that you don't feel uh, will, you know, came out well and you want to redo it before submitting it. Remember to update your PDF. The post-production team will need an updated PDF with any word changes you make during the process. Literally every word needs to be accurate. So anytime you alter a sentence during the process, please immediately update your PDF. This is going to work better if you practice ahead of time. Find what's wrong in your sentence structures. Like sentences can be completely grammatically correct in your book, but just impossible to say they might have commas or semicolons. You might have to restructure them. Um, you might run across tongue twisters, things of that nature that are just hard to say. And you want to change a word or two here or there. You're allowed to do that. You're not allowed to do um, entire rewrites of sections, but changing a word here or sentence there is not a problem for us. Uh, we want you to have the best audio book possible, so that's the way to do it. Um, make sure that you change everything in your PDF, and um, then go ahead and record it all, and that way your PDF is going to be completely accurate and completely in line with uh, your recordings. So plan that out in your schedule, because if you're only planning to do recordings in your schedule, um, this is, you know, you're going to find you're going to need additional time. You're going to want to rehearse sections of your book, find what's wrong, alter it, 
and then do the recording. Submitting your files to post-production. So your raw files go into the same Google Drive folder that your sound test went into. And all you have to do to submit your files is tell your producer in your personal update room that they are ready. Your producer is going to give your files the once over, ensure that all your chapters are present, and then communicate with post-production on your behalf. So that's it. That's all you have to do is make sure all the files are correct. Make sure your PDF is complete and in that Google Drive folder with your sound files. And then just tell your producer, hey, I'm ready. The wait period. It can take anywhere from two to four weeks from the time you submit your raw files for them to be fully reviewed and the first cut of your audiobook created. During this time period, you can simply relax and rejuvenate. There are no expectations for you except perhaps to attend some of our marketing workshops at that point in time. Your producer is going to receive notes from the post-production team that you're going to receive on which sections were golden and which ones were problematic and need a redo. The final stretch. So you're going to have two weeks from the time you receive your audiobook back to record the new material before the final copy needs to be resubmitted to post-production for the audiobook's final version. It typically takes the post-production team another two to three weeks to finalize it once your files are submitted. You are going to get a, a cover. To review, the art team is going to take your book cover and convert it into the square size file you need for your audiobook. Usually, they're going to have it ready by the time your polished audio files are in review by the post-production team. And while they're not going to be creating a new cover for your audiobook, simply converting your book cover uh, from uh, what it looks like on the on your soft cover uh, to now this square shape, it's still going to look new and fantastic. So your last chance edits, you're going to get an opportunity to listen to your audiobook after the post-production team completes it. If there's any blatant errors, they can be fixed, uh, especially if the errors are on our side. Anything that we do wrong uh, that came out incorrectly, obviously uh, we're going to fix. We want you to have the very best audiobook possible. So then you're going to upload your files. And just like you uploaded your soft cover and ebook files to the distribution networks, you're going to do the same with your audiobook files. We're going to teach you in the program how to create an ACX account and upload your files. As you own your audiobook, you can then decide what other distribution networks you want to upload to. Your decision should be based on your business model and your goals. There's a lot of distribution networks out there now. And um, some, you know, very famous, some not as well known, but might be right for your business model. So you're going to want to start doing research and really start figuring out, you know, do I want to give the audio book away for free, for instance, to increase my my um, listenership and my brand and use that as a lost leader um, in order to promote myself and get workshops and, and speaking engagements? Or do you want your audio book to be uh, for sale? And do you want it to be, obviously it'll be for sale on ACX, um, but with some of the other outlets out there, you have choices on, on how that's all gonna work, what the price point is gonna be. And again, you can consult uh, with me, you can consult with your producer, on some of uh, some of the best methods out there right now. And that's really all I have to say. It's not really rocket science. You're going to narrate your book. And again, we'd like you to do 25% of that um, every week, including this week. So hopefully you're already starting to do that since we're, uh, since it's Wednesday already. But um uh, be aware that uh, if for any reason you're not able to make the six-week deadline, uh, we do have fines and penalties. So if you're having a real problem, uh, do reach out to your producer 
and and let me know. And if there's uh, any kind of emergency or anything like that, um, obviously we'll we'll discuss it. But I want everyone to be aware of the of this now, so that you're not surprised. Um, this is kind of an intense situation where, yeah, please do get 25% of your book done each and every week for the next four. That gives you two weeks to really listen to it and, and really decide like, I want to re-record this section and get us the best material that you can. Thanks very much for uh, your time today. And, uh, any, any questions that come up, reach out to your producer. And uh, if your producer doesn't know, your producer will reach out to me and we'll get those answers for you. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.